Hi everyone, welcome to Buffet Minded, the unboxing. I'm so excited. I got my very first Smeg item. It's an electric toaster. I have wanted this for so long because they're so expensive and it's not like they even get great reviews, but they're so cute and I know it's going to look great on my counter. So this is what the box looks like when it comes and I guess I thought that was a bug. I guess it's a shoe. Don't step on the toaster. So my son tells me people love unboxing, so I'm going to unbox. Now, even though I ordered it from the dreaded Amazon, it came not in an Amazon box. It is in a Smeg box. So I cut the tiles. Ooh, look at the color inside. Looks like this. Okay. I can't hold the camera and lift it out, so I'll be right back. Here is the beautiful Smeg box. And you see what color I got? Green. It's my husband's favorite color. I probably would have gotten blue, um, but we are decorating our lake house in greens for my husband because it's really his. So here are all the things it does. Reheats, defrost, and bagel settings. Has two large slots with automatic variable width features. It has a crumb tray and a cute toast pops up when cycle ends. Little, little thing, little knob, so cute. Okay, let's open it some more. Oh, can I do it one-handed? Let's see if I can. Okay, so this is what it looks like inside. Pristine, no one's ever opened it before, good. And here's the booklet that comes with it that you know I will never, ever look at. I mean, does anyone look at books anywhere? Oh, there's my finger. No, no, that's not my finger, that's the box. Sorry about that. And the cord is very interesting. Let's take out this. Oh, okay. here it comes. Here it comes, people. That's how they do the cord, not very neatly. Hmm. No, usually they're so neat. Okay, oh, look it, it comes in a wrapper that says, Meg. I found out about the brand Smeg from watching so many YouTube videos of tiny homes. This is my favorite. Oh, this isn't paper. It's more like a, it's like a, almost like a cotton. Yeah. Oh, look at how beautiful it is. Smeg. There it is. A beautiful greenish color. Tonight, I'll review it. I need a toast for dessert. And there's the little uh, knobs. And here is the cute writing of Smeg. Yes, this was very expensive for a toaster. It was $199. I know. It was ridiculous. But look how cute it is, guys. It's worth it. Pretty color green, too. But we'll see how it works tonight. So, it actually says to use the toaster without any bread in it the first time. So, I'm doing that. Look at the cute little light, how it lights up. That's darling. Uh, it has a little bit of a electrical smell. You know how that happens. But, um, sure is cute. Sure is shiny. So, I'm looking at all the um, control panels. So, there's a defrost button. As you can see, the little snowflake. There's a browning control knob that goes from one to six. There's a browning indicator, which is the level. There's a reheat function. There's a stop function, a bagel function. And uh, what's that one? What's that one called? Let's see. I'm actually looking at the owner's manual. Can you believe it? It's like the first time in my life. Let's see. Let's find a picture of it. Intended use. Way to toast things, I would imagine. Use before first use, that's what I'm doing now. Heating it up, cleaning. I thought there'd be like a um, description of each of the buttons. This is what I was looking for. So there are, huh? I don't, I don't see where the, um, Oh, there's a lot of heat coming up from the top. I don't see where these little pop-up handles are. So let me explore that a little bit. Be right so back. So 
This toaster cost $199. You would think it came with these optional sandwich baskets and, and uh, bread trays and things. Nope, it doesn't. So those pictures of six, seven, eight, and nine, and picture D, optional. I don't have it. But I do have the defrost button and the reheat button. And we'll see how it works tonight. I'm really excited.